William Longespe, 3rd Earl of Salisbury was an English noble, primarily remembered for his command of the English forces at the Battle of Demmer and for remaining loyal to his half-brother, King John. His nickname, Longespe, is generally taken as a reference to his great size and the outsized weapons he wielded. Early life He was an illegitimate son of Henry II, King of England. His mother was unknown for many years until the discovery of a charter William made that mentions Comitus Ida, Mater Maya. This Ida de Tosney, a member of the prominent Tosney family, married Roger Bigot, 2nd Earl of Norfolk in 1181. King Henry acknowledged William as his son and gave him the honour of Appleby, Lincolnshire, in 1188. Eight years later, his half-brother King Richard I married him to a great heiress, Ella of Salisbury, 3rd Countess of Salisbury. During the reign of King John, Salisbury was at court on several important ceremonial occasions and held various offices. Sheriff of Wiltshire, Lieutenant of Gascony, Constable of Dover, and Lord Warden of the Singh Ports, and later Warden of the Welsh Marches. He was appointed Sheriff of Cambridgeshire and Huntingdonshire about 1213. Military career He was a commander in the King's Welsh and Irish expeditions of 1210 to 1212 and was appointed Viceroy of Ireland, jointly with John de Grey, Bishop of Norwich, when the King left for England in 1210. The King also granted him the honour of I in Suffolk. In 1213, Salisbury led a large fleet to Flanders, where he seized or destroyed a good part of a French invasion fleet anchored at or near Dammer. This ended the invasion threat but not the conflicts between England and France. In 1214, Salisbury was sent to help Otto IV of Germany, an English ally, who was invading France. Salisbury commanded the right wing of the army at their disastrous defeat in that year at the Battle of Bouvines, where he was captured. By the time he returned to England, revolt was brewing amongst the barons. Salisbury was one of the few who remained loyal to John. In the civil war that took place the year after the signing of the Magna Carta, Salisbury was one of the leaders of the King's army in the south. He was made High Sheriff of Wiltshire again, this time for life. After raising the siege of Lincoln with William Marshall he was also appointed High Sheriff of Lincolnshire and Governor of Lincoln Castle. However, after the French Prince Louis landed as an ally of the rebels, Salisbury went over to his side. Presumably, he thought John's cause was lost. After John's death and the departure of Louis, Salisbury, along with many other barons, joined the cause of John's young son, now Henry III of England. He held an influential place in the government during the king's minority and fought in Gascony to help secure the remaining part of the English continental possessions. He was appointed High Sheriff of Devon in 1217 and High Sheriff of Staffordshire and Shropshire in 1224. Salisbury's ship was nearly lost in a storm while returning to England in 1225, and he spent some months in refuge at a monastery on the French island of Ari Acute. Death he died not long after his return to England at Salisbury Castle. Roger of Wendover alleged that he was poisoned by Hubert de Burgh. He was buried at Salisbury Cathedral in Salisbury, Wiltshire, England. William Longespe's tomb was opened in 1791. Basali, the well-preserved corpse of a rat which carried traces of arsenic, was found inside his skull. The rat is now on display in a case at the Salisbury and South Wiltshire Museum. Likeness a terracotta statue of Longus Pay, dating from 1756, is located in the Great Hall of Laycock Abbey in Laycock, Wiltshire, England. A likeness of his wife Ella is also on display, while several other statues are believed to show their children. Family By his wife Ella, Countess of Salisbury, he had four sons and six daughters. William II Longus Pay, who was sometimes called Earl of Salisbury but never legally bore the title because he died before his mother, Countess Ella, who held the earldom until her death in 1261. Richard, a canon of Salisbury, 
Stephen, who was Seneschal of Gascony and married Emmeline de Riddlesford, widow of Hugh de Lacy, 1st Earl of Ulster. Their two daughters were Eleanor Longspee, who married Sir Roger Lazouche and Emmeline Longspee, who married Sir Maurice Fitzmaurice, Justichar of Ireland, Nicholas Bishop of Salisbury, Isabella Longespe, who married Sir William de Vesa, Ella Longespe, who first married Thomas de Beaumont, 6th Earl of Warwick, and then married Philip Bassett, no issue. Ida Longespe married firstly Ralph, who was son of Ralph de Summary, Baron of Dudley, and Margaret, daughter of John Marshall. She married secondly William de Beecham, Baron of Bedford, by whom she had six children, including Maud de Beecham, wife of Roger de Mowbray. Ida II de Longespe married Sir Walter Fitz Robert, son of Robert Fitz Walter, by whom she had issue, including Ella Fitz Walter, wife of William de Redding. Ella's and Williams's grandsons include William de Clinton and John de Grey. Mary Longespe married, no issue. Colonel Longespe 